Good day everyone! This presentation will cover post-harvest handling of some spices. The discussion will be divided into two parts. Part 1 will cover proper food safety, equilibrium moisture content, and drying of spices. Part 2 will include storage and transport consideration for spices. Some of actual field experiences will be also discussed. Food safety is very important in drying, storage, and transport of spices. Food safety standards are very particular with presence of contaminants in the spices which causes harm to the consumers. These contaminants include macrobiological and microbiological agents. Macrobiological agents that contaminate commodity during drying process include stones, seeds of other plants, and foreign materials. These contaminants may come from the drying floor or pavement or the surroundings. Presence of such contaminants may render low quality to spices. Clean drying eliminates these contaminants. Microbiological contaminants include microorganisms such as salmonella and fecal coliforms which could come from unclean drying floor, especially when the drying area is prone to soil contact. When the drying floor is also a source of molds and fungi, there is a huge chance of aflatoxin contamination. Pesticide residue is also considered as microbiological contaminants. This microbiological agents poses harm to human and animal health. Hence, it is a must that hygienic drying must be practiced. To what extent do we need to dry the spices? How can we ensure the spoilage of the commodity will not occur during storage? How does drying prolong shelf life of food produce? This can be explained by the principle of EMC or equilibrium moisture content. Agricultural produce are harvested at high moisture and must be dried up to 65% RH for safe storage. There is an equivalent moisture content to 65% RH for specific commodity at a given temperature. Generally, for higher temperature, equivalent moisture content is lower. Spoilage occurs when RH of food is high. Hence, 65% RH or lower is advised to prolong shelf life of food produce. Agricultural produce must be properly dried to have a successful storage. Dried produce must be also stored properly to avoid deterioration due to microflora and insects. The diagram shows the relationship between the moisture content of commodities and the equivalent relative humidity or RH. Food produced for safe storage, I dried up to 65% RH or lower. RH greater than 65% allows molds to grow. An RH of 85% or higher favors anaerobic bacteria which allows unwanted fermentation or deterioration to take place. This would in turn make the food unsafe for consumption. Hence, it is a must to maintain an RH of 65% or below for stored commodity to prevent mold or microbial proliferation and spoilage. Higher RH also favors growth of aspergillus species that produces aflatoxins. Strict regulations are now in place for presence of aflatoxins in food products due to its harmful effects to humans and livestock. Proper drying avoid 
proliferation of molds, hence, could also address problems with mycotoxins. Here are some lists of recommended moisture for some spices which are equivalent to 65% RH at 25 degrees Celsius. For red chili pepper, 10%, lemongrass, 10%, black pepper, 10 to 11%, ginger, 10%, turmeric, 10%, and cinnamon, 14%. The spices must be dried up to the recommended maximum MC to ensure safe storage. When the prevailing temperature is much higher, adjustment must be made to preserve quality of spices during storage. Spices are much more sensitive compared to other agricultural produce. Hence, care must be taken when drying the spices. Improper drying leads to loss of physical chemical properties of spices such as flavor, aroma, and color. Here are some pointers for successful drying of spices. Drying must be always hygienic to avoid macro and microbiological contamination. When choosing drying methods, Qualities of spices must be preserved. A drying equipment must be equipped with a mechanism to protect the spices from sudden rain. For spices, a temperature of 45 to 60 degrees Celsius must be practiced to prevent over drying, which often results in loss of aroma, flavor, and color leading to spices of low quality. It is recommended to utilize shade drying to light sensitive spices such as lemongrass and turmeric. A non-transparent or UV protected cover must be used for drying these commodities. Along with shade or UV protected drying, proper ventilation must be also utilized to ensure that right moisture is attained after drying process with enough time to avoid deterioration of under-dried spices. Here are some field stories of successful drying of red chili pepper using GrainPro Collapsible Dryer Case 2 and Solar Bubble Dryer. Red chili drying, as shown, was done in Pakistan using CDC2. The Grain Pro CDC protected the RCPs from contaminants such as soil particles, stones, and foreign matters. For conventional drying, RCPs were found to have high level of aflatoxin, dusty, with broken and discolored chilies, full of trashes and high wastage due to rain. When using Grain Pro CDC2, RCPs were protected from contaminants as well as overall quality of chili were much better. CDC2 enables rapid closing to secure commodities in case of sudden rain with its pulling straps and heavy duty zipper. It is also equipped with inflatable sidewalls to prevent spillage and protect commodity from contaminants. The SBD as shown was utilized in India for second stage drying of RCPs. The RCPs were initially dried using sand drying. To further reduce moisture of these RCPs for safe storage, SBD was utilized. The SBD protects commodity from intermittent rain. Since it is designed as a drying panel, it prevents entry of contaminants and highly promotes hygienic drying. When drying freshly harvested spices with high moisture, it is recommended to use elevated rock with SBD for efficient removal of moisture by preventing heavily moist air 
to accumulate in the drying tunnel. Regular mixing is a must to ensure uniform drying. An even moisture content leads to quality deterioration and spoilage during storage. The grain for drying solutions for spices promotes hygienic drying, protects commodity from contaminants, allows mobility and flexibility, uses renewable source of energy, can be installed in areas without power grid, and protects commodity from rewetting due to sudden rain. For more information about grain pros drying, storage, and transport solutions, please visit www.grainpro.com. Thank you.